Before we get into the topic of this video, we are moved to Asia, your strategic partner in Asia, helping businesses to start and leverage their actions in the country. We can help you to facilitate with market entry services such as finding right partners and suppliers from you and on all the paperwork side to fully register and operate a business legally. We are basically acting as a one-stop shop to assist foreign entrants to start their business in Vietnam. So as an entrepreneur, if you are looking to expand or to do business in Asia, Vietnam become one of the key markets to consider. And actually, there are a few sectors that you can put the spotlight if you want to surf this booming trend that is happening in Vietnam. The first sector is about import-export. And let's start by the disclaimer. To succeed in import-export, you need a good understanding of international trade regulations, logistics and market trends. Building relationships with reliable suppliers and buyers is also crucial for the long run of your business. Regarding the ideal investment and depending on the scale of your operations, an initial investment from 20,000 to 100,000 US dollars could be a good starting point for setting up an import-export business in Vietnam. This would cover costs like licensing, product sourcing, marketing, purchasing the actual product and logistics to the end destination. Vietnam's exports thrive across a diverse range of sectors showcasing the country's raw material supply and skilled workforce. And here are some key made in Vietnam products to consider. The first product is furniture and home decor. The wood and wooden furniture industry in Vietnam faced challenges in 2023 with a minus 15% decrease compared to the previous year. This decline was driven by a combination of factors, including a significant drop in consumer demand in key markets like the US and Europe. Despite these challenges, Vietnam remains a major player in the global furniture market. Second idea is textile and apparel. Drawing from a rich heritage in textile sewing, Vietnam exported 40 billion worth of textile and apparel products in 2023, meeting global fashion demands with a combination of traditional techniques and contemporary designs. Third product idea is footwear, and similarly, the footwear industry has also achieved significant success exporting 20 billion worth of products in 2023. Renowned for functionality, Comfort and style made in Vietnam shoes caters to diverse markets worldwide, leveraging quality materials and skilled craftsmanship. Coffee, seagrass, tropical fruits, and rice, known for their freshness, taste, and commitment to quality, has also gained favor among international consumers. If you want to anticipate upcoming trends, new product developments, and the attractiveness to foreign-owned companies, you can also focus on electronics and consumer goods. First, Vietnam has become a major hub for PCB assembly, with companies like Samsung and Intel establishing production facilities in the the country. So electronic related products represent a significant opportunity. The semiconductor industry is also rapidly expanding with Vietnam attracting significant investments from international players. Global electronic giants like LG and Panasonic solidifying Vietnam position as a key player in the global electronic supply chain. Then you have consumer goods and as the country's manufacturing capabilities expand, there is a growing demand for high quality raw materials like metals, plastic, chemical, supporting various industries. The rise in demand for high quality electronic stylish household items and luxury goods, both domestically and internationally, could increase the demand for Vietnam products that meet this criteria and high standards. Logistics-wise, major ports like Ho Chi Minh City and Haiphong serve as logistic hubs capable of handling cargo, departure and arrival connecting Vietnam to the global shipping network. Because we talk about import-export, let's also mention about importing products to Vietnam. With the rising high and middle class increasing keen to purchase foreign goods, Vietnam's import market is also thriving in categories such as beverage, FMCG, cosmetics, and perfume. If you are looking to expand your product distribution overseas in key Asian markets, Vietnam is an excellent entry point to gather customer feedbacks, face less competition than in China, and operate in a business-friendly environment as a foreign brand. Second business sector that you can consider as an individual or corporation looking to expand your footprint in Vietnam, it's about IT. 
We will cover about startup and also the IT development center that you may have heard. And let's also start with a disclaimer. Succeeding in the IT sector requires technical expertise, a strong understanding of market trends, and the ability to adapt to rapidly changing technologies. An ideal investment to start a tech venture in Vietnam can mostly be from 20,000 to 30,000 US dollars to set up a small software development team. Obviously, if you are thinking about larger scale project, it will immediately push up the initial investment. Ho Chi Minh City and Da Nang have become hotspots for tech and startups in Vietnam. Vietnam has a thriving software development seeing putting the country as a major player in the software world. The country has a huge pool of talented programmers and designers, making it a go-to place for innovative software solutions. Talking about IT, we also have the outsourcing angle. Vietnam's software development market is projected to reach 500 million by 2024, and a significant portion of its growth is fueled by the IT outsourcing sector. Vietnam has become a global outsourcing hub, attracting businesses from around the world, thinking for cost-effective, highly skilled freelancers, as well as comprehensive A to Z software development services. IT is a growing market in Vietnam with a projected annual growth over 10% yearly. Just like anywhere in Europe and in the US, Vietnam also has a startup ecosystem that is equally exciting with young entrepreneurs and seasoned investors turning ideas into reality. Notable startups like Sky, Mavis, the creator of the blockchain-based game Axie Infinity, and VNPay, a leading mobile payment platform, have gained international recognition for the innovative solutions. Other promising startups like Lowship, a food delivery and logistic platform, and Tiki, an e-commerce giant, have rapidly gained traction in the domestic market. The successful Vietnamese stories are among other ventures expanding their market to Vietnam and rapidly growing to the tech-savvy nature and adoption of technology by Vietnamese people. Vietnam's vibrant tech sectors, including edutech, health tech, and fintech, are rapidly evolving and driving innovations across the country. Third thriving sectors, it's about hospitality and FNB. Especially in big cities like Ho Chi Minh City and Hanoi, if you have experience managing or operating cafes, restaurants, bars in your home country, or making food such as crepes or bakeries, this is a country where the culinary scene is huge and demanding. But for this sector, let's also start by a disclaimer. To thrive in the F&B sector, you need to have patience for food, a solid financial foundation, and a focus on adaptability and fast learning. Understanding local tastes and preferences is also essential as this market is super competitive. Regarding an ideal capital investment, and depending on the type of F&B venture you are considering, an initial investment can start from 40000 for a small cafe or food stall to maybe 150 thousand US dollars for a full veg restaurant, which may have a high monthly rental fee if it is in a central location. You need to renovate the venue, furnishing it, hiring staff such as chef, barista, security, and waiters. If you are seeking starting an F&B business, Ho Chi Minh City, Saigon, Hanoi, or coastal cities like Nha Trang, Da Nang, or Phu Quoc would be your best bet. Vietnam's food and beverage scene is not just about traditional restaurants. It's a hub for creativity with visionaries like Peter Kung Franklin, the chef owner behind the renowned An An Saigon that are pushing the boundaries of Vietnamese cuisine, blending traditional flavor with modern culinary techniques. So whether you are a new entrant and you would like to start a business from scratch or you are already an established corporation, you would like to spread your product or services to Asia, so Vietnam is definitely your first door for Asia. If you want to get our insights about your product or services, get a first hint about what we think, how could be your journey leveraging in Asia, you find below in the description more detail about our products and services. We can give you some first hint about how to get started and open you our whole scope of services for market entry. If you enjoy the video, Leave a thumbs up and I see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye bye. Pin down and I'ma get it right.